For Minnesota's flag design contest, someone just submitted a picture of their dog. Hmm, yes, here's the official Minnesota website. Meanwhile, submission number F-156. <laughs> I mean, what's more Minnesota than this? All these other attempts in the background are lame. Dollar, can you guess what this country is? Portugal? That is um, not correct. For a dollar, could you guess what country this is? It's close. Mexico. Okay. It's not right. For that a dollar, one, it's just, it is country? Mexico without the coat of arms. Russia. For a dollar, can you guess what country this is? Canada. <laughs> <laughs> China's blue. <laughs> Excuse me. For in a dollar, an alternative can you guess reality, this country? yes. It doesn't matter for a dollar. Mexico, that's right, right. There we go. Two dollars right here. Uh, China. We China, should be able it. to at least I can get. This one. Italia. Italy, only five. Oh, it's about time. Uh, England. England. England, yes, that's it. And it's funny oh, about this? <laughs> no, wait. Uh, Belgium. These guys are from Europe. They're too Yeah, good. exactly. Yeah. They're from Europe. It doesn't even count. No thanks, buddy. I'm American. This goes against our culture. New whiteness map just dropped. Has a word for toe versus call toes, fingers of the feet. Obviously, in the English-speaking countries, we have toe. We don't use the word fingers to refer to our toes. And apparently, they do that in German-speaking countries, Hungarian, and and the Nordic places. Meanwhile, in all these red spots, they're just finger toes. I can't speak for all the other countries, but for example, in Spanish, fingers are dedos, and toes are dedos, de los pies. <laughs> <laughs> Fingers of the feet. There's an official entry in the Arthur TV show Wikipedia page for Mao Zedong. He appears as a pitcher in a background on one of the episodes, which has to prove if this former Chinese leader exists in the Arthur universe. There's likely also a certain Austrian painter that exists too. If humans can only hold their breath for 10 minutes, then how was Louis Armstrong able to become the first man on the moon? <laughs> I love this song. Did you know they actually recorded this track on the surface of the moon? I am in space. <laughs> the lyrics were a little different back then. Hello, Europeans. I'm an American with a very bad sleep schedule. This is literally me. I just went to Silly Billy Island and everyone knew you. In fact, I actually think you're the president of the Isles of Silly. When will you return to take your throne as king? 8% of Americans say they could beat a lion in a fist fight. This is the most American-ish ever. I remember reviewing this data not that long ago. 9% of us said we could beat a crocodile. I do unironically think I could fight a wolf. One, just one. The sixth biggest Polish YouTuber scrolling list of people with active warrants. That's me! Ah! Uh, what exactly is going on in Polish YouTube? Do I even want to know? People in Croatia after enjoying a nice glass of Coca-Cola. Yeah, apparently that's something you want to avoid right now. Was a Serbian some Somehow behind all this superheroes are dumb if I was a millionaire I would use my money to help people meanwhile those very same people when mr. Beast does just that apparently he's not allowed to do good things how strange which country do you like more um it seems rush over Turkey rush over Morocco rush over Italy rush over Germany Russia who is this man exactly he's acting as if he is the current leader of Russia why is Putin making TikToks in a time like this. 13th siege century week. live siege stream week. during the siege week. The siege, huh? It's time for siege week. Lady Anne says, who were we besieging? It's the time. Earl of Busterbrook. It's time we're to really donate a lot. Right now. A wooden Fergus, spoon? That wooden spoon. Not sure how that's going to help in the siege, but, but every little bit helps. Once we get to 50k likes in this live, we'll start <laughs> the, <siege laughs> the awkward guy. Man, just look at this dude. There is no one more excited for a siege week than him. Bro, please do not take our castle. This is looking awfully Albanian in the background. The funny thing about actual real life sieging is this could have happened. Like, believe it or not, it wasn't always about just scaling the walls or something. It was more like, hey, we're going to sit out here for several months, make sure no food gets in, and pretty much allow everyone to starve. So everyone could have been doing these TikTok live streams while it waits. Siege week, more like siege year. The longest siege ever was 26 years. Sometimes the side chick ain't even a chick. It's actually just the glorious and proud nation of Ireland. Obviously, I'm home now, but I was in Ireland for a couple days. I feel like I met more people that recognized me here than in any other country I had been in. Is it because I look like a leprechaun? The oldest living shark 
is older than the USA. Bro, how is the shark older than the USA? I doubt the shark has been alive for 2023 years. What? The earth in the USA was created 2023 years ago. I doubt the shark was the first person alive. Thank you for that background information, sir. His argument is impenetrable. Richard Nixon always believed in reincarnation. He died back in 1999. Meanwhile, I Spice born in the year 2000. Welcome back, Mr. President. And he's looking better than ever. I didn't know I was in love with Richard Nixon this whole time. Someone pointing out this man's name being Julius Caesar. Meanwhile, there were 16 men named Julius Caesar that fought in the Civil War. This is pretty much just a countrywide tradition at this point. I had no idea, but I now know I need to immediately obtain a son. You don't see ambulances asking for money. Meanwhile, everyone here in the USA. Yeah, if I'm ever in a medical emergency, I'm definitely calling an Uber. When you get injured in America and someone threatens to call, uh, I'm good, buddy. Luckily, I have this liquid just in case a limb ever falls off. I'm not about to pay $3,000 for a 10 minute ride. I do not stand with Russia. I do not stand with Ukraine. I do not stand with NATO. I do not stand with the UN. I stand with big to uh, what? Japan's flag is also a pie chart of how much Japan is Japan. 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 Looks like you forgot your Romanian lesson again. You know what happens now. Oh, please do. Oh, stay away from my family. I know this is a historic Romanian punishment, but I wasn't trying to get this invested. The nine most terrifying words in the English language are, it's the tickle monster. I'm coming to tickle you, said Ronald Reagan. This is legitimately the most terrifying sentence when you're like below the age of 12. I'm legit gonna pee my pants. Good fences make for good neighbors. But in Romania, they say bad neighbors make good fences. Okay, again with the Romanian just... Uh, uh. I wonder why this guy's name was Vlad the Impaler. Kangaroos are just deer who went to prison. I just love the amount of people fighting kangaroo videos that come out of Australia. Like, I've seen so many, I, I feel like everyone's probably doing it every day. I'm a little jealous. Can I try? You know what? On second thought, British people waking up and realizing they have to do the accent all day. I feel like at least once a year, we should give them a break. The whole world's not gonna end if they just talk normal. China figures out a process to farm caviar, thus saving wild sturgeon from extinction and make a delicacy widely affordable to the masses. Meanwhile, the American press, after China turned it into a cheap snack, caviar is at risk of losing its status as a luxury. I just tried this for the first time recently. Not bad. I've put worse things in my mouth. In Costa Rica, pooping in the urinals isn't just acceptable, it's encouraged. These urinals in Costa Rica each have their own toilet paper dispenser. Finally, I can serve my purpose here on the earth. Turns out Costa Rica is the only country that's sold allows it. No, I think that paper is supposed to be used for other things. A Russian lawmaker suggests they should take the Statue of Liberty and move it to Moscow, since he believes Russia protects the rights of other countries more than the US. Yeah, I me. don't really know how uh, well that would go, but they can certainly try. Star Wars came out in 1977. Here's what stormtroopers were before 1976. I'm always surprised to find out how many people don't know there were stormtroopers before stormtroopers. Shakespeare watching Gen Alpha create new words every week. I guarantee you if Shakespeare was alive today, he probably would have been the first one to say God when the leader of China is in San Francisco. Meanwhile, San Francisco on all the other days. What's funny is they admitted it's true. Yeah, they're, they're trying to make the city better because this guy's coming. Um, that's true. Because it's true. My roommate trying to learn German. So do I remove the space and make the two words into one long word? His German tutor, I can't have this conversation again. I've noticed this about the German language. Still my favorite German word I've ever discovered. Germans on their way to remove spaces from a description and call it a word. I mean, if you think about it, do we really need a space there? Using the space bars for the week. Disney characters, names explained. Simba means lion in Swahili. 
Swahili, Nemo means no one in Latin. This dude means friend in Swahili. And then there's Woody, which means... I, I can't say what that means in English. I wonder what the meaning was behind that. <laughs> My six-year-old son is showing me the phone he made with two cans and a string. Meanwhile, me showing him the phone that kids his age in China make. What a loser. This isn't even a smartphone. I knew I should have given you up for adoption. Men in 1915. Meanwhile, men now. This is just one of those trends things. It just always comes back around. China treating foreign names as this that do not have a meaning in our language. Nah, China choosing to break down four names into their constitute syllables and assigning meaning to each creating a nonsensical string of Chinese words to represent its foreign name. The only reason why I know this is because like a single map I saw. I don't really know why they do this, but it does make for some very interesting translations. Gargoyles for real be sitting there for 12,000 years like. And is it any wonder we don't still make gargoyles on buildings today? It's kind of inhumane. Arrives at your boating school to take a driving test. Claims he is ready. Refuses to elaborate further. Somehow obliterates literally everything using only an automobile. Vows he will return. Leaves. And of course, he will be returning tomorrow. SpongeBob was actually just a massive fan of property damage. Excel was invented in 1985. Meanwhile, people before 1985, it was seriously where like depression rates severely increased. There's like whole creators on YouTube and TikTok just based off of like their incredible Excel skills. <laughs> Wish I had that ability. The nucleus of a hydrogen atom with its one orbiting electron. Now imagine you pretty much just have to do this forever. Not too bad of a life. Virgin B names Honeybee, Carpenter B, Bumblebee, Mason B. Meanwhile, Chad Wasp names Murder Hornet, Executioner Wasp, some killer uh, Tarantula Hawk. The thing is, the names match though. These things are truly evil. That's right, I am a bee supremacist. I don't like bees, but they're better than hornets. Germany to make military the backbone of Europe's defense. Meanwhile, there's Poland. Um, I mean, Poland was already focused on Russia. Do you really want to, like, have them looking both sides again? Especially with the history. 19th century labor conditions. Okay, yeah, I remember that. 20th century labor conditions. Mm-hmm. 21st century labor conditions. I mean, things are kind of on that way. My great-grandson is probably going to lose a limb in the factory. It's all good. It's like character building. And big thanks to the patrons. Drew, I'm your dad back with the milk. Look outside. John Denver. Luxembourg lover. I can't sleep without Drew's voice. Aaron F. Amateur arc Archaeology, uh, Fat, Carmel, Norwal, Frederick, Tiblin, Good Old Ryan, Inquisitor, Jack Trigger's annoying friend, Let me know is ten. Best Robert, Ryan. E, the Pie, the Great, Sebi, if you Ralphie, hear this, the Mexican I love you, and why am I doing this?